Our question was simple. Whether golfers choose the golf ball based on brand or whether the golf ball actually has an effect on their playing capabilities. To test this, we set up a controlled experiment where we hit 60 golf balls off a controlled surface at a controlled target and measured the amount of backspin created in a measurement of control for the golf ball. Hi, I'm Colin. I'm Nick. And we're here to talk to you about golf balls. So we're here to answer the age of the question of whether a golf ball actually affects the We're here to decide which golf ball out of the top name brands of Titleist, Strixon, Amy, give a golfer the most control around the green and better than a spin. So we have our pro here and we've had him hit total of 60 shots from a non yards out of this hole uh, from outside and we uh, just had him hit and now we're going to go ahead and do it. As shown in our results, the Pro V1 golf ball produced better numbers in a measurement of spin rate than the other golf balls we compared it to. Across the board, all of our players showed development in the spin rate category when using the Pro V1 golf ball. Opposed to the Shrikshan and the Alien, the Shrikshan golf ball came in second place. This was the same for all players across the board as well. The Alien came in third. This also was the same for all players across the board. Overall, all three players produced better with the Pro V1, then the Shrikson, and very last, the Alien. This also is the order of how expensive each golf ball is, respectively, the Pro V1 being the most expensive, followed by the Shrikson and the Alien. Overall, this supports our hypothesis that the most expensive golf ball produces the best control over the green. This is because the more expensive the golf ball is, the more likely it is made of better materials and better technology. Overall, through our experiment, we were able to conclude that it's not just the brand name that gives the ball its price. It is the technology and effort made to craft each golf ball to give it a better ability around the green. In conclusion, all golfers who want to improve their game should use a more expensive golf ball because it is used, made with better materials and better technology if they want to improve their game quicker and easier. We're here at Mount Side Golf Course. We got a Colin Anderson hitting onto the ice. <laughs> he doesn't make Nick McAllister hitting onto the ice. This is a pretty freaking awesome sign if I do say so myself. It's hard to see. All right, here she comes. Dude! 